Hi everyone, how are you guys doing today? I hope you're all doing great. I'm trying to test StreamYard uh, on my page. On my page, this is my first time using StreamYard to broadcast. I'm using um, Facebook. I'm, I'm, I'm using um, Zoom. Zoom to do my broadcast. So I want to see if you can hear me. If, uh, if you can hear me, I want you to drop one 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 in the chat box. I am on my page. It's my first time using StreamYard to broadcast. I'm using. Um, I used to use Zoom. I mean, if you can hear me, drop one 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 in the chat box. If you can hear me, please close that door. If you can hear me, drop one one. In the chat box, uh, you tell me where you are joining me. This is your coach, trainer, the boss of the global bosses, Hal Stambo. Hmm? Where's I want to talk about words that will limit you, limit you in your business. Oh, guy, great, 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 great. I can see. Oh, man, I love, I love, I love the, what I'm seeing here. I want to talk about words that will limit you. Oh, guys. Um, oh, guy, great, 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 great. I so, Ma Malakai, yeah, Mal Malakai, or Malakai, yeah. I can see you. Yeah. How are you? <laughs> Hi, you guys. Uh, oh. Mary, Chioma, Oma, Oma is Potako. Ah, I hope you guys are doing great. Chidema, Chiom, Odia, Monica, Tiang. Wow. Man, it's like I'm going to be using StreamYard. Wow. What I'm seeing, what I'm seeing, I love it. It means I can even see those who I'm chatting with live on, on directly show. Oh! God. Okay, let me go straight to the point because um, I have a training coming up. My financial and business intelligence training coming up by 8, 8, 8 p.m. So I just want to spend a few minutes with us here. Now, what are those words that are limiting us in our business? Words that would that usually limit us in our business, growing our business. If you show, if you see um, uh, what I shared with us. Uh, today, that is a, a memory, memory Facebook reminded me of. That was two years ago. I had it when I joined my business, I already had it in mind I'm going to have success in the business. I already began my business with the end in mind. But I see people join business. I see them, men, okay, uh, sorry, I don't know how to remove this. I think I'm learning how to use uh, stream yard so don't don't uh you know okay <laughs> adelabo i don't know how to remove this now <laughs> okay let me just go ahead maybe when i'm when i'm done i will um Oh, great. So I'm, I'm learning how to use StreamYard. And, I, and it's like it's very sharp also. When it's something you can even connect to your YouTube and other social media network at, at, it, at a go. Uh, I'm used to Zoom. So I see people join network marketing or any business. They have seen people have success in the business. And um, they make statements like, The products are too costly. It's very hard. The products are too costly. I have seen people who are, who are not making it in the business. So I don't think I can make it. Or let me try. Yeah, let me, let me just talk about the word try. Let me try. Anytime you use the word, let me try. Just think about it. Look at the feelings you have when you use the word let me try it, 
it limits your energy, it limits the power in you. Anytime you are using the word, let me try. I'll try it. Why try a business? You have seen people have success in the business. Why try such business? What's the essence of trying? Instead of going all in in the business. So whenever I see people use the word try, I knew where they were going, where they are going in their business. I already knew where they are going in their business. Because you don't join a business to try. You already have seen people have success in the business. So why use the word try in your business? Go all in. Go all in. As long as someone in the business has, has had success in the business, it means you too can. Even if you don't know how to do the business, the only thing you need to now do is to learn how to do it than trying how to do it. So stop using that word, try. It's not for those who are hungry. It's not for those who really want success in their business. So if you truly want success in your business, you will never start with the word try. Yeah, I can, I will. Those are the words you need to use. It's possible. Impossibility is nothing. So words are powerful. Words either gives you energy or weakens you. And so what are those limiting words that you are using in your business? What are those things, those things you are saying to yourself that are limiting you in your business? Another word is, you know, you are lucky. Lucky. I don't believe in luck. I don't know if any of you guys believe in luck. For those of you who believe in luck, there is nothing like luck in any business. There is not, there is no luck. When, when uh, preparation means opportunity, people call it lucky. Forget about luck. Nothing like it in your business. It requires hard work. If when, when I add, when I had, when I uh, uh, when I was failing in school, I knew what was wrong. I knew I was not putting in the time, the effort. When I when I when I was struggling with my reading ability when I was in school, I knew what I needed to do. I need to wake up early. Then I was playing too much. I had to reduce my playing in order for me to put more time reading more books, add add extra classes in order for me to learn how to read. So if something is not working in your business, it means you need to put in extra work. You need to put in extra work. You need to work hard. Forget about the word smart. It is later on your business will be smart. But I'm, I'm working smart. That's why I'm making the money I'm making. Freaking, I don't know what, what to call it. Forget about that word smart. In the beginning of your business, you have to work hard. It is hard work. He was doing seminar late in the night every day, talking to 20 to 50 people every day. It's freaking hard work. Even if you have to use your phone talking to people, it is hard work. Hard freaking work. And so telling someone telling you that it's going to be easy, the person is just trying to deceive you. The reason why we use the word easy is because it's better than the, the nine to five job. That's why we use the word easy sometimes. But don't confuse easy with hard work. I want you to drop that in the chat box if you are, if you are hearing me. Don't confuse easy with hard work. With hard work. Don't confuse it. You have to work hard for you to have success in your business. I knew where I was coming from. And I knew I had to put in the energy, the time to go all out to build my business. And so it's hard freaking work. So when you have worked hard, in the beginning of your business, it will now be smart work. Smart work later on. And so when smart work comes into play, when your resource starts speaking for itself. You get it now? When your resource starts speaking for itself, it comes into smart work. People are attracted to you because of the results you've got in your business. But in the beginning of your business, even all through your business, you have to be showing up. 
you have to be shown. Those who are lazy don't make it in our business. Lazy people don't make it in our business. And that's why they complain. They are the ones who complain. When little things happen in the company, they are the ones who complain. You get it now. They feel others are using them to get to the top. Nobody, or if you have this feeling that someone is using you to get to the top of your business, you're not going to make it in this business. There is, imagine me telling Dangote that Dangote is using me to get to the, to the top of his company. Are we not buying his product? What if I'm having that feeling that is making use of me? That's why it's, it's rich. You need to have the spirit of abundance. You need to have abundance mindset. Get it now. Don't feel that because others are having needs, you will not have it. There are so much wealth in the world. There are so much money in the world. There's abundance of resources in the world. No one has uh, authority or, or, or how would I put it? No one has monopoly over a particular money, resources. Uh, no one has monopoly to become a billionaire. No. You too can become a billionaire. I can become a billionaire. That's the kind of mindset that has really helped me in my business. So let us just stop here. Maybe tomorrow we'll continue with the rest words people are using to limit themselves in their business. So I want to really thank you guys for joining me. I know the times we are living here now is tough. Uh, it is much respected. So keep safe and always, always. Always believe in your business, in whatever you are doing. Trust in the process, and you surely have success in your business. I'm loving this new uh, stream yard. I, I recently, I've been having some issues with Zoom. And so I believe with stream yard, I, can, I will be able to be going, going live or coming up live now. I love what I'm seeing because if I was using Zoom, I had to be looking at my phone to be seeing those who are commenting uh on on, on, the, on my facebook wall but now with Streamyard, i can see or uh, everyone uh on the chat lo i love it this is great love it fantastic okay bye guys see you guys uh tomorrow bye bye